Good morning, or actually good afternoon where I am. Oh, I have picked up a, a junk journal that I have not looked at in a while. Um, it's a really, really special one and I need to figure out a closure for it because it's getting chonky. Um, but this was a beautiful book. I took out the pages and I use it. Um, I use the pages because it was hand-drawn nature from this woman. Get her name but yeah beautiful oh actually here's one of them um yeah it was a very beautiful book but i was thinking about going through it and looking at the things i've done and choosing a page to work on ah i have issues paper issues This is a really cool bookmark I found in a, in a book that I, sorry, my lighting in here sucks. I don't have a ring light. Let's see if I can get this to, um, happy place, some journaling, painting. Oh, I really love this page. Some of these pages are not yet. Oh, this one is so pretty too. Oh, we've still got some. Oh yeah, my first little interactive thing. I still don't use pockets a whole lot. Um, more journaling. More journaling. Oh, I love this page, these pages too. These were some of my, these are, a lot of these are some of my um, 100 day project, which, you know, I stopped doing, although I'm still creating art every day. I'm not specifically doing that. Another pretty artsy page or nature-y page. Mm, this was an interesting color. I never even really like did anything with that. I just spread the color out. I've... My attempts at drawing. Ah, I can draw when I'm looking at something, but I cannot draw from my own brain. I'm just not. That's just not. Yeah, I thought this looked funny. It was a local thing that I never went to see. Um. I've done more in this journal than I thought. Mm. Oh, it's from the back. Oh, I think most, oh, nope. Oh, ah! There's this beautiful nature page. That might be it. Nope, nope, nope. There's these pretties. Oh, it looks like I didn't finish something. Oh. Okay. It's interesting. I don't know why. Oh, we've got some beautiful colors on this page. Oh, I never finished it. Hey, I don't know why I do that. This is a print of a um, like large scale collage I did and I scanned it because uh, I love it and I will use it again. This is rice paper. I don't know if you know what rice paper is, but that's fun. Oh, here's another one. God, I, I didn't know that I had so much in here. This is probably a journal that I could really work on to get to getting finished. It looks like I messed up the binding in the bag here. I said this was one of my first. But that's okay. Oh, still one more signature. Anything in this one? I messed the binding up on this one. Yep, I did. So I need to find a page. All right, I have pulled out. 
some snippets of things. I have been drawn to pink so much lately, people. And um, I'm not I'm not backing off anytime soon, I don't think it looks like. I've got a lot of pink in here, some black and white. I found this quote that I wrote that I found that says, everything you've ever wanted is sitting on the other side of fear. I'm thinking about cutting it up to fit, but I could also kind of do a, a middle, you know, a creased deal. But first, let's play with the Kawaji Wazi. I have no rhyme or reason to how I do this. Not a single. I just do what looks good. I know that I like to have sets of three or five mostly. Um, I don't want to just like put two things together or have one randomly by itself. Um, it's kind of that rule of threes thing that you learn about with art. Everything. So everything. Sitting on the other side of. No, everything I ever wanted is sitting. Everything you've ever wanted.
other side up here. All right, I moved the ever to up here. I'm currently gluing it down. Everything you've ever wanted is sitting on, sitting on the other side of here. <laughs> I hate this. I hate, hmm, maybe, well, oof. Oh. Ugh. I think I'm gonna do it like this. <sighs> oh, you guys, sitting. On the other side of here. is sitting on the other side of here. Ooh. Maybe I like that. You know what, it's your art. It doesn't have to make sense to anybody else. Don't let other people's ideas about what art should be influence you. Now, you can let it influence you if it's something that you think is great, obviously. But if you like something and you have heard other people talk about it not being, eh, it doesn't matter. You do you. That's the beauty of art. It is in the eye of the beholder. It is so subjective and that is what makes it amazing. You know what? I'm going with this feel like I need to find something to go here image-wise, so I'm going to go hunt for something. I just realized I forgot to turn the camera back on, um, but I found this little owl um, who looks <laughs> who looks a little fearful and um, I decided that he was he was it so i think this is done simple easy i like it the end